bacteria, bacteria, art with bacteria, drink to that, yeah, oh, uh, wanna see it, oh you will, and you want to believe what this guy did to his arm, <laughs> So the other day, this really bored biologist decided to paint with strains of bacteria. Indeed, paint bacteria. Bacteria. That's how Alexander Fleming discovered penicillin. Don't you tell me that art is good for nothing. Don't you dare. Yay for science and creativity and you for bacteria. There are people that create art with bacteria. Yes, they do. Art like this. Like this. And like this. And this and this and that. And even though I am such a germaphobe and uh, you, I think it's pretty cool. I love it. But I am a germaphobe. But I love it. <sighs> what if somebody used flesh-eating bacteria to create art. People mutilate their bodies all the time for art. That's just how artists are. Dedicated. Ha, you were thinking I was gonna say crazy? No. Dedicated. Not crazy. Dedicated. Passionate. Not crazy. Like, you know, this guy that just had an ear implanted in his arm. Why not? He even planned to connect a microphone to have people around the world listen through his ear. Ear, arm, arm, ear. So what do you think if somebody had a controlled flesh-eating bacteria art? No, not me, somebody else. And if somebody's gonna do it, maybe that should not be me. Would you consider this art or just a call for attention? A desperate one, very desperate. No, I don't do bacteria. Mm. Leave a comment below and I will tell you what I think. I'd rather paint with a snake. Please don't forget to favorite this video and like it. This actually helps me a lot and I want to bring a lot of trivias to you and whatnot and poke your brains until you're like, oh, leave me alone. <laughs> so, thumbs up for art. Good day. Dedicated. Not crazy. Dedicated. Passionate. Not crazy. It's your cookie. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.